Good afternoon. The fly tipping of garden waste in Birmingham since charges were introduced has now become a local election issue. In February, the Labour controlled City Council brought in an annual £35 fee for the curbside collection of green waste as part of its efforts to save £102 million in last year's budget. It's not the only council in the region, though, to charge for the service. In Herefordshire, the council will only collect garden waste if it's in special bags which costs £3.50 for five. Worcester charges £10 to register for its scheme and £47 a year after that, while in Bromsgrove there's a £35 annual fee. But in Birmingham, the Conservatives are now calling the new charges a garden tax, while the Liberal Democrat MP John Hemming is threatening to take legal action to make sure any dumped rubbish is cleared. Kath Mackey reports. Piles of garden waste dumped in Birmingham. We found these bags on a street in Rubri, and standing beside them, an angry Conservative politician, demanding the Labour-run City Council stop charging people to collect their grass cuttings. People are thinking, well, why should I pay £35 to have my waste collected, when actually this is something that really should be included in my council tax. So we're saying, scrap it and refund the people that have already paid. Over in Yardley is an equally excised politician who's threatening legal action against the council over the waste that's being dumped. They should scrap the charge because it's clear some people can't afford it. It's creating a major mess across the city. And if the city looks bad, there's, there's very clear evidence that if the city is untidy, it encourages crime. Birmingham City Council is dealing with some huge political issues at the moment, not least the allegations that extremists are infiltrating some of the city schools and what to do about children's services. But the issue for many people on the doorstep is this stuff, the collection of garden waste. A lot of people have been contacting Midlands today through social media. Ros Ratcliffe told us fly tipping wasn't a particular problem in my road before, but it certainly is now. Many agree with one viewer who said that charging for collection of green waste is ridiculous, while another felt if you've got garden rubbish, pay for it. This is what cuts look like in Birmingham, yes, and, and, and we still have a further £300 million to cut out of the City Council's budget over the next couple of years. It's, it's going to get even more difficult, I'm afraid. As I say, I don't welcome that for a moment, but equally I don't deny it, and it's our job as a council to face up to that situation, be honest with people, and do what we can with the money we have available. People who continue to dump waste in the city are being warned they could face fines of several thousand pounds. Kath Mackey, BBC Midlands Today, Birmingham. Four men have been sent to...